Okay, are we here? Are we live? Please, fingers crossed. Yay, okay. I think we're good now. Don't want to jinx it, but I think we're good. I completely forgot what we were talking about because we had another stream like last time where everything just went wrong, but that's not going to ruin our day, right? Oh, uh, hi, YouTube. I got to introduce YouTube, right? I forgot how to do this. YouTube, welcome back. Um, yeah, we've been having fun here, um, and, but we haven't even started conlanging yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump in and we're going to look at a really cool text made by someone on our discord in the language quack so um, let's just zoom over to the side webcam and let's get our our sheets organized here and let's go side webcam right there we go so this is courtesy of Swedwerta gatamnya on discord so thank you very very much um, this is a really cool text. I'm going to have to do some formatting here. Um, but basically, it is the first text in Pquak, and it is really cool. So let's go through and read it. And we can do our glossing and everything. Let's zoom over to Pquak, close everything else. There we go. Okay, so we have the translation here, which I'm going to quickly, quickly just organize because I was super prepared. Uh, before this and I already uh, totally got this all working um, and we have our original we have our English translation I'll do a, a quick reading um, and then we will we will jump in okay so the text Tarsuka anis besut sakit nokmen nit nis dudu Nom quangwa qua brus qua liap quat. Tarsu scam suit. Su scam clui ma pna ma uh, mon. Tpian maliao mas diao su dos akit. Maliap patahu. Su liap clui ma mon ma pkao quenok gakao hu benok. Brings a tear to your eye. This is so cool. And the, the English translation is just down here. Let me get everything onto one. Okay, there we go. It fits now. Don't see strength in people. The person judges everything that takes space one by one. To use or eat or suffice to, or to give up on. Don't bless the human. Bless the sea, wind, and island. The sand, river, and, oh, sorry, the sand, water, and rivers don't judge, but accept those who suffer existence. Accept sea and island, and finally will your soul be everywhere. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. Oh, wow. This strikes me as... I, I said this in the Discord, and by the way, YouTube, if you are not familiar with the Discord, it's links down in the description. Um, when I saw this in the Discord, I said it, it reads like something that a religious reformer might write. It's really, really cool. So why don't we do some... Uh, some glossing and, and see how the grammar works here. So, away we very slowly go. Sorry, Lucy, I, I realize you're going to have to cut that later. <laughs> okay. So, tarsu. Tarsu is our negative imperative, if I'm not mistaken. Let's take this and let's um, see if we can... We can sort by quack. Let's sort alphabetically by quack. There we go. Okay, so tarsu negative imperative. Tarsu ka anis besut. I don't remember all of the. Uh, oops! No! 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 Wrong! Bad! Terrible! Quack. That's what we need. So we need to just scroll. We don't want to search. We want to just scroll calmly. Calmly scrolling. Calmly scrolling. Ka is C from the Proto Sakrat. Kra. Do not see anis. Anis, I'm assuming, is the word for. Do we have. Where is it? Let's look for strong. Uh, I don't know why the, uh, the sort didn't work with that. Do not see strong. Besut. Um, 
bay is our locative marker and suit is the word for person from proto sacrat susut okay tarsu ka anis besut don't see strength in people excellent this is actually kind of the first sentence in Pequak. This is kind of awesome. Is anise also seed? Uh, seed, we have sui. So we do have a merger uh, with the word for seed, seed and free, coming from proto sacrat sli and sui, uh, both going to sui. But I think that's all. Yeah, I think that's all. Don't see strength in people. Okay. More space for the glosses. So we know suit is person. Person. This is really Colin versus technology, um, as as Echo pointed out. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not actually this bad with technology normally. It's just, well, I don't know. Maybe I am. Maybe that's just some Dunning-Kruger action there. But uh, I feel like I get by in the world. People ask me for help for you know, with things, you know, Colin, how do you get this working? Colin, you know, how do you, you know, how do you get this on, on Google Maps? You know, they come to me and here I am making a fool of myself on live TV. No matter. That's what we're here for. If you can't make a fool of yourself on live TV, where can you? Incidentally, I have made a fool of myself on actual live TV in the past, but I don't think any of you will ever be able to find the footage. So that's fine. Anyway, dosrakit, to judge. Uh, so that's the proto form. Dosakit is the quack form. Person, judge, nok, all. It's interesting, quack is not that divergent from proto sacrat, phonologically at least. Uh, I think what we wanted, we may want to do is introduce some, some fun new grammatical constructions uh, at some point just so that's not super samey <laughs> don't tempt the online people yeah well no such thing as bad publicity right uh sakit nok men nit nis all right what is men w h all what Interesting. I think this may actually be an innovation in Quack, which I'm perfectly prepared to to accept into the grammar. Um, because everything that, I think that we would probably use the relativizer A for that in proto -Sakrat. So having the WH um, word being used as a relativizer is cool a cool grammaticalization pathway. And uh, I'm, I'm here for it as they... Uh, as they say. All right, so then, neat. How do I, where, how's that gonna, ah, here it is, shine. Let's see. We have, yeah, it's, this is the only option. So, neat. Shine, self. This is interesting. So, in the translation, we see the person judges everything that takes space one by one. And I'm thinking, this is a really interesting translation. Shine self to take space. And then what else do we have? Do do. Do do one by one. Call versus technology. Excellent. Okay. So because I am not good with keeping names uh, sorted out on Discord and in the chat here, if this is your... If this is yours, please do let me know so I can give appropriate credit. Uh, I used the the Discord name, but um, but if you're here on stream, I want to uh, to extend uh, a congratulations. Okay, and so uh, just just while we're we're thinking about that, oh Taga, oh well done. This is so cool, Taga. Thank you very much. Um, so everyone, Taga. Ah, uh, yeah, everyone's got different. It's probably good that everyone has different uh, names on different places. Prevents, you know, people finding embarrassing footage of you on live TV. Um, but I digress. Okay, so we have siut dosakit nokmen nit ngis dudu. 
So the person judges everything that takes space one by one. And so, Taga, question. <laughs> Am I tempting the internet people? Okay, so let me ask Taga a question, then then I'll tell you the story. Um, what was my question? Oh, yes. Yeah, so this is this usage here, Nitnis, um, shine self. You've translated it as everything um, or as take space. Do you have any thoughts about how that... Um, you know, about that translation, if there's a, a cool story to be told about how that meaning came about. Um, and then, okay, let me just, yeah. So the story about me on TV is not that interesting. I'm making it sound more interesting than it is. Um, I was in, I was in Peru uh, a few years ago. And um, for one reason or another, I ended up at a TV station um, because uh, someone, uh, someone I knew worked there as a producer and uh you know, I got, you know, it's like a fun thing to do, right? Oh, why don't you come in and see a filming of one of these morning shows? And so, yeah, that sounds fun. So I, I went in and, you know, I was sitting in the back of the studio and they were doing all this stuff and they had people come in and, you know, they had a singer come in and they had, you know, like a chef or something, you know, these, it's like a morning show, all this, this normal stuff. And then they said, oh, and by the way, we have someone very special in the studio and they wheeled the, uh, the camera around and there I was sort of like um sort of stunned because I don't know I, I I'm not used to having a you know being on actual live tv and this was before streaming or before anything so I um you know as as awkward as I am on camera now you can just sort of extrapolate it backwards and it's even even more awkward I've gotten a little bit comfortable by now but and it was in Spanish which I was totally not prepared to speak at a moment's notice um on that particular morning so yeah there's a there's a clip of me being kind of stunned <laughs> on peruvian tv somewhere um i don't know if they keep those tapes but uh yeah so that was the story um under here no though this is the isolating family so this is sacra we haven't gotten to uh uh <laughs> blombo dombo yet um because i wanted to to pay tribute to taga's um Tagus translation. So, okay, back to back to this. Um, that's my little story time over. All right. So, yeah, we have a cool um, usage of of men as a relativizer here. Excellent. All right. So then we can continue. Uh, this is don't see strength in. No, we've done that already. Boop, boop, boop. Oops. No. To use or to eat or to suffice or to give up on. This is really cool. Okay, so let's go down to nom. Nom use. And qua. Qua is. Is qua or? So where's qua? Why isn't it showing me qua? This is one of those weird sorting issues. Or is qua a new word? Well, we have the author here. <laughs> is the stream being bad again? Is it just. It's just a bad luck day for me. All right, seems like we had a bit of freezing. I'm going to stop and I'm not going to do anything interesting until we get this dealt with. Oh, oh, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. It was YouTube. Okay. Wow. Goodness gracious. Um, so I'm going to just use, uh, I'm going to introduce this new word then that Taga has invented. Oops, back to the side webcam, please. And, or. So, nom. Nom, 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 right? Nom to use. Okay, it's not nom as an eat. It's it's moi as an eat, right? Yes, moi as an eat, which also seems very eat. Eat, e. Use or eat or bruce to suffice, to be enough. Suffice a great translation here. Or liapquat. And yapquat is our phrase meaning um, to give up. All right. So then let's put in a new entry here into the Pequot dictionary for or. Nope, that's not how you. Nope, that's not how you do it either. Colon versus technology, round two, fight. So we have qua here meaning or. And who knows if that comes from Proto Sakrat. All right. All right, good. We're about halfway there. 
and it gets easier because we start to remember the words that uh, the morphemes that are used more frequently. So tarsu we've seen before, um, negative imperative. Skam I believe is bless, uh, and suit is person. So don't bless the human, bless the sea, wind, and island. So let's put that up here. Oh, and this is interesting. This is interesting. So we have a positive imperative, su, which I believe is an innovation in Pequak as well. And I really like that because we have tarsu, be unwilling to, being used as a negative imperative. I think in proto sakrat we just use the bare verb as the... Um, as the imperative, but why not use the this form su meaning want as the uh, as the positive imperative? That's a really cool um, analogical formation. All right, <laughs> yeah, it's not column versus tech; it's tech versus column. I'm on the defensive here. I'm on the ropes. Okay, suskam klui. Let's find klui. Ah, clui. This is a really interesting um, phonologically divergent form. Clui from kusli, meaning C. And then we have ma and wind and island, I'm assuming. Um, let's just double check. Mon, yes, island, and pna, pna, wind. It, it kind of reminds me of... Um, the Greek word for breath, which also starts with a PN. All right. Okay, two more lines, and then we will know the full truth. The sand, water, and rivers don't judge. The sand, water, and rivers don't judge, but accept those who suffer existence. All right. Indeed. Okay, so, the pian, the pian sand. And Liao. I know Liao is water. And Zdiao, Zdiao is river, right? Ah, uh, yes, it's this Sidal word, this really interesting one that, that we've reconstructed with a, an impressive array of meanings. Really, what this indicates is that it turns into a variety of different um, words in, in different daughter languages. Um, and here we have a daughter language that uh, uses it as river. This happens a lot when you have um, when you have a root that shows up in many different uh, daughter languages, but it has a wide variety of meanings. How do you reconstruct it? Um, unless you know something about the the history, and and it's a, maybe it's a very common pathway of semantic shift. Um, you have to sort of reconstruct it with a a meaning that is kind of able to accommodate all of those uh, daughter languages. Yeah. So credit where where credit is due. This is Tagus. And then, where were we? Ah, yes. The sand and the water and the rivers, su, want, and dosakit, judge. Oh, I'm getting, I'm getting a note from the author. Pe is supposed to be men. No, oh, I'll, I'll wait on the line until we get a clarification on that. Sea and sand and the water and rivers. And this is interesting. The translation is don't judge, but we have su here, which is want. Is there something I'm missing? Is there something I'm missing? There often is, as you've noticed, chat. Or maybe this is, maybe, um, Taga, what you're thinking of is tar, meaning not. Oh, pa. Men. Got it. Change that. Um, I will continue and ma is and or but so here we can translate it as but except who um, and then tahu tahu translated as suffer existence so this is this tra uh, root in proto sakrat uh, who suffer and who is our word let's see where it is up here uh, our word to have or to exist. So who suffer existence. So I'm going to, I'm going to make one emendation here to say tar. 
So give that the negative. And then the last thing is imperative except C. And th at this point, we basically know all the words. Su, imperative, liap, except, clui, si, ma, and, island, and. And kaukwenok, that means finally, in the end, something like that. Kaukwenok. Let's go and see the origin of that. So this is one thing we used before a long time ago. Um, Bakalkwenok is the is the protoform um, to end, so to arrive, literally, you know, word for word, arrive. What's the rest of it? Arrive, crossing, all. Arrive, crossing all. So to come to the end of everything. Um, that crossing is also used as a comparative morpheme. So, yeah. So that's in the end. And finally, ga. Oops, got to get b to a, that other Sakrat language that we haven't worked on yet. And finally, you, uh, second person pronoun, kao, kao, so, exist in nok. Nok, what's nok? All. So, literally, this line, imperative except C and island. So, except C and island. And finally, uh, your soul exists in all things. Whoa. Cool. Taga, thank you so much. This is a beautiful text, and it's the first text in in quack which um by the way everyone okay i'll stop this segment because i want to talk about some other stuff now um so this is a natural space to stop um thank you youtube for being with us here today and for bearing with me and, and for listening to my little story and for and for sort of witnessing this really cool um this really cool text that Taga has has made for us in Pquak, the first text in Pquak ever. So a gigantic round of applause um, to Taga. Thank you again. And uh, YouTube, we will see you next time.